Greetings, St. Margaret of Cortona. We are moving into the third week of Advent and preparing our hearts and minds for the birth of Christ. Although things are getting exciting, remember that we are asked to focus on the true meaning of the season, staying awake and being ready. As I be continue to become more familiar and comfortable with this medium, I will continue to make small adjustments. But always know that the body of the email and my news blog on our website will have more details for you. Now, this coming week, we have several events and want to avoid confusion. We start with Wednesday. Our students will have a Christmas buddy activity that will take place in the classrooms. Older students will work with our younger students on a craft and maybe read a story together. Each set of classes will be creating and doing something different, and we are looking forward to seeing just what it is they do. On Thursday, our pre-K students will entertain their families with holiday songs at their Christmas celebration. Doors will open at 8.45 a.m. and the program will begin promptly at 9 a.m. An invitation has already gone home. Also on Thursday, the Student Council is holding their annual Christmas sweater contest. All students are invited to wear their silliest, most creative, or ugliest Christmas sweater. Students are encouraged to be creative and show off their personality while still maintaining standards of appropriateness. Then on Friday, we herald the coming of Jesus and Christmas with our annual Nativity Pageant. The doors will once again open at 8.45 a.m. The program will start promptly at 9 a.m. As we have the last few years, we are inviting everyone to stay after the pageant and share in some fellowship with the entire school community. We will have refreshments provided by our student council, and we'll listen to some Christmas carols and maybe even a sing-along. Parents may take their children home and begin their vacation at any time up until 11 a.m. The school will close at that time. At the pageant, we will draw the winner of the tuition raffle. If you do not have your raffle ticket, get one soon. The winner receives a $1,500 tuition credit that will be used for this school year. We are also going to hold a 50-50 raffle, and some lucky attendee will go home with some shopping money. There will be no after school that day. Also, Kids in the Game has started summer camp registration. Head over to their site for details. And we are planning for spring enrichment. Look for an interest survey in the coming days. Finally, I have a request. I would like to establish a decorating committee that would assist in adding some cheer and color to our hallways. If you're interested, please email or call and we'll meet soon to plan. That is it for this week. I pray you have an enjoyable weekend. God's blessings to all of you. That's a wrap, everybody. Great job. See you all next week. Thank you.